This video is me taking my Micro Machine version one. Uh, it's a video I did a, kind of a while back. Uh, I'll leave the link at the end. But I kind of take that ship and kind of modify it. I wanted some better capabilities like weapons and uh, just better looking ship overall, I guess. So uh, that's basically what I go through in this video. I did this on a live stream, so it is going to be a little bit long, but I kind of just walk through some things. All right, enjoy. Grab drives an A. Okay. So let's... Um... So that's my reactor, so let me just take that out. Oh, uh, yeah. Um, I want to add reactor. So I want to add... I could add the smallest. What, what's, like, the least weighing one? Uh, this one. So far, that seems to be the least weight. I tell you what, I don't want to, uh, I mean, that's so tempting to kind of go that route to, to make one that weighs the least, but I tell you what, I'm gonna, I'm gonna not go that route. And what I'm gonna do is actually make the best ship I can without making it larger. Uh, I'm not gonna worry about mass. I'm not really talking about mass. I'm more talking about, uh, um, volume footprint i guess if you want to call it that um let's see power generated that one's not bad most likely yep i think i'm gonna go with this b class so delete that Ship has too few landing gear. Oh yeah, because I just added some weight. Um, not a big deal. It's not a big deal yet. Get there. We'll get there when we get there. And I need grab drive. I need some more ship mods as well for experience. Yeah, it yeah, it's just messing around. I mean, I honestly will. I'll be pretty honest. I have no ambitions really to go through the NG plus other than just to say I went through it. But other than that, man, I like if all you're really getting is a little bit different, I guess, story in it. But I mean, it's just kind of like a power grind, in my opinion, from what it sounds like. It's not like uh, I don't want to do it. I do. It's just me. I don't feel like uh, I feel like I, it's like I have to have to do grab drives. Yeah, I want one of these 27s. So there's two 27s down here. I'll take this one, it has more health. All right, there we go. Okay, so we got some engines. I'm not gonna worry about that right now. So, let me see landing gear. Let's see if we can get some, what kind of lander thrust one. Oh, um, I just might try to do all quests I can and maybe just start a new game if interested. Yeah, that's just kind of another thing I want to do is like I've gone through a lot of the quests and I kind of was thinking um, I do want to actually knock out as many of the quests I can because I don't even know if I'll, I'll try to do that again I'm sure I probably will but um, oh here it is gear um, shoot they don't have good gear here that sucks That sucks. Okay, so Habs. It's, it seems like I might have to. Oh. I 
points. Uh, so I'm lose all my hard earned stuff. Okay. Hmm. Okay, that was no I was, I was hoping to uh, find one horizontal. There is one somewhere out there. I need to probably go find that. So let's grab drives. Get, man, uh, the gear at this place really sucks. I don't want any of those gear. one do I have here? 100G HE3 tanks. Let's see. Okay. Trying to think of how I want to do this. So I want to get rid of the. All right. Well, I'm gonna have to do a landing gear another time. I don't like any ones that are here. Um, I guess the the one I kind of want to have better looking engines. Uh, I don't need anything that big. Are these oh this is uh so uh that's C class fancy do you find that doing ship at outpost is best um it actually is pretty good because you have a lot of the non specific like it, they have like doing shipbuilding at your outpost is very uh, it has like all of the general um, kind of component, ship components. So that is actually kind of nice. I would actually go do it at my outpost, but my outpost seems to not work. Uh, the little panel doesn't work there, so I don't. I don't know. Chalk that up to another bug in the game. I okay. That I could maybe put on top. Which then, if I did that, I could actually put something on the side of it. So I kind of dig that. And then what if I duplicate? Can I... Can I rotate it? Doesn't look like it. Damn, that would have been nice to be able to rotate. So, engine thrust. Oh yeah, that's a lot better. It was a lot better which curious if I can't duplicate it because I don't have it here that sucks um what I can oh, I need something that sticks on the side.
with. And I don't think this will work, but I'm gonna just check something real quick. Okay, that can go. go away. Oh shoot, that did work. Well, son of a gun. Uh, ooh, that's awesome, because then, I mean, what are my warnings? Yeah, okay, just the, oh, shit, hold on, I, I want to do that. So then, I can actually just move this to the back. I can't move it there. So I'd have to move it there. Is this the docker? It is the docker. Okay. 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 Um. Hmm. Where's the dockers? All right. One error. I know what that's going to be. That is going to be the super awesome. My ship is taller than my docker, which that cannot be. I do know that. Now, I guess my question is if that circular cir circular ring there, <laughs> I don't know why I was retarded about that. Uh, if that, oh, you know what? What were some of these other dockers? Um, I have to make it off to the side. I could put this one back if I need to. Hmm. I could do a double decker and then I could put a docker into the front. I could do that. That could be a, a possibility. Let me see if I can move this thing off the top here. I have no idea where I can move this. I can't really move this thing anywhere. So I'm gonna have to find another way to get uh, my shield generator. So let's see if we can get another shield generator on here. Oh, that does work. Okay, I just gotta get shields on here. Oh, that is, let me slick it. I don't even know what that means, by the way. No clue. Oh, that was, that is awesome. Okay, so, where is, Shields. Okay. Um, so I kind of like some of those. That's a C class, C class. Stay in the B's. I could put the dome back on top. But could put that back on top. But I think I want to go with this sucker. Oh, son of a... Damn, that would have been so nice to be able to add that on the side. Uh, is there a good cockpit? 
like really any of these. I was wanting one like this size, but I would like to have a hard point on top. And I, I just don't, don't see him. Why don't you do the max shield thing? Uh, what do you mean, max shield thing? Is there something I don't know about? <laughs> Enhanced cockpit. I mean, the other thing I could really do is just go with this big ass. Honestly. I'm actually considering going with this big sucker. Um, the dome gave you max shield. Oh, um, I can't do that. I can't do that because the dome would only go on top, on top here, and that would be too tall. I can't get it above the docker. That ring on the docker, you can't have anything outside of that ring. Like, um, mine is a vertical docking, so I can't have anything protruding above the top part of that um, same thing goes for if, if you have a dock your dockers out to the side or even onto the front yeah you can't it can't go past that barrier so um, I tell you what let me let me let me let me uh, let me zoom out first um, let me let me, let me, let me do this. Uh, is all this just storage difference? Is that basically it? Yeah. Let me, let me. <sighs> so it won't, it won't dock in here. That's what it's saying. Okay. Okay, let me let me check the bays. Let's see if there's a good bay here. Bay, 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 bay. Uh, that's a door. I want a top. Do they have any good top loaders? No, it doesn't really look um actually. Is that a good top loader? I can't, it, that's kind of hard to tell. No, that's a, it's a door into the side. I didn't really notice the door over here. Yep, there's the door. Okay. <sighs> Hope Tech Landing Bay. Okay, so, all right. So that's the uh, that door on top. Anyways, this little door on top where the arrow is. I guess that is it telling you. Yeah, I haven't really noticed that before. So sue me. I can't get that there. That is a real bummer. Damn. I might be able to do this uh, maybe with some different uh, different components at other spots. But dang, what is uh, what is this mass of one? What is this mass three? Mass of five. This is a mass of twelve. Damn. I would really like to have got that here. So this thing works. That's cool. I was able to actually get rid of thrusters, uh, two side thrusters. 
Um, I actually was able to even pick up some hard points I can put on the side here. There's not really anything else. I mean, I could put some weapons on. Not really. No, not really. See, that's why I'd like to have a be able to have a flat top hard point on top of the cockpit, so I can I can put a weapon up there. Cause, yeah. Shields. Yeah, so I'll show you this. Uh, so I can put this dome. I can take this dome thing, put it on top, and then now I have two errors. Um, multiple shields. Yeah, don't worry about that. But uh, the bottom error there, the invalid docker module position. Docker modules need to be on an outside edge of the ship. Basically, that's what the uh, what the what it's saying is like the docker is not on the outside edge. So. That is a funky looking ship, but I was able to get a flatter docker on the ship. Um, not horrible, but damn, I, oh, you know what? Oh, oh, let me get that bay. Let me get that bay back. I just thought about that side loader. Oh, damn, I wish that side loader went up. Doggone it. Damn, I wish that side loader went up. It doesn't, it goes down. Or it goes, comes out to the side. I like how small this one is, but the problem is that it literally just goes into the side here. Uh, did you ever capture a Starborn ship? I never captured a Starborn ship. I got close, man. I got real close once. I got real damn close one time. My jump range on this thing is 30 light years. That's pretty cool. I like that. Not the most aerodynamic ship at all. Um, yeah, that'd be below the ground. Um, you had to wait outside the door and jump in to it as they're coming out. Yeah, I uh, I didn't know where the door was. My so it was my first time actually getting there. And I didn't know where the door was, so yeah. Um, I'll tell you what, I will save, save this. There we go. Okay, so let's see what we can mess around with. Um, I, I want to see bays. That probably is going to be a big issue for me. Actually, would love. Ooh, ooh, that's a. Oh, that's a door straight ahead. Damn. But, 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 but. It is a one. That is that is tempting because then I can just add a hab module. Yeah. 
give me a sec. Give me a sec. Um, cockpits. Oh yeah, we got a lot of cockpits to choose from. Looks like this Magellan might not be bad. Let me see here. Like that's not awful. Not awful. And I get the hard point on top, which is basically that's what I really want. So I can add in a weapon up there. So let me let's see Magellan. So that was the the one X. Magellan C2 cockpit C2X. That just doesn't have the hard point up top, man. And honestly, I kind of. Maybe, maybe I'll go with that Viking. Kind of tempted to go with that, man. Just make the cockpit a little bit larger. Damn. Whole crew stations. I got four crew stations in. Uh, wait, what? I can't. Why not? Why the hell? I wonder if that's because the door, the bay door actually looks like it would protrude into the cockpit. Yeah, I don't know. That is rather annoying. Uh, looks like it a little bit. <sighs> damn. Um, damn. Okay. <sighs> Son of a beasting man I was really looking I was really digging that let me see was there another one up here oh this one won't dock don't line up okay one exit is two crew stations all right cool gotta work I'm gonna get rid of that Get rid of that. Boom. Boom. Need to add another hab module in the mid there. Let's see, hab. Where is habs? Uh, unless it's got a double, is it any two, two talls? No. I don't think there's any like two or three talls in the game, which is really kind of annoying. I could uh, this actually could give me a little bit of diversity if and I wish uh, this is another thing I wish you can kind of have is a little bit of a filter like I want to see just one by ones no tech like they're all all the one by ones are the same so it doesn't mean a damn thing Ship. 
Up, oh, there's the docker. And honestly, what I could do is I can actually extend this out. Before I get into gear, let me uh, let me finish the rest of this in the back here. Oh, all right. Full tanks. I cannot fit on any of those. So where's reactors? Director B class power generator 21. So this is probably the one I got. Which kind of sucks, man. Damn. Because man, I would really like to have that that hard point note on that back end, like that one has. Man, that sucks. I, I have to have a B class reactor. I don't have, I guess I don't have to. I just have to downgrade all the stuff I put B class, the B class stuff I put on. Hmm. So I'm actually okay with that. Let's see if we can change the grab drive. Oh, I'll do this one. Oh, this will be perfect. Get out of there. Okay, perfect. So then I'll have the hard point note on the back. Um. Hmm. I mean, I can always put that. I'll just leave that there for now. Let me let me see if they're is another shield that can go on to the back um, it does not look like it yeah it doesn't look like it that sucks because man if i have one stick off the back that'd be perfect that'd be perfect i guess the other thing i could do since i have this hard point that sticks on the back i could just do i could just do this just elongate this out. So this all works. Wow, that landing gear is jacked. That thing looks so unbalanced. <laughs> that looks so bad. Just for the sake of my sanity, I might just balance out the uh, uh, the landing gear. <laughs> Oh 
you know what? Oh, what the hell? Why are you so low? I forgot. I, for I wouldn't be able to do that. I could do that. put the fuel tanks in front of the uh, right behind the engine that would be hilarious actually let me let me see fuel tanks perfect um ones that attach oh that'll be perfect um i got these grab jump fuel 50 massive 10 so um those are 50 Starship design rank two. I'm not there, man. I am not there. And honestly, I don't. I mean, I could probably just go with these seven, the 70 grab jump fuel. Uh, this, uh, the M20 here. Nope, 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 fire. Oh, oh, because it protrudes into the engines. Yeah. Oh. Could do that. Could do that. Honestly. Side tanks. Flip. Yes, sir. I like it. I got. I actually think I made a little smaller footprint here. Because I was able to get rid of two fuel tanks. I didn't really need the two fuel tanks, honestly. Um, and honestly, I can go back to the original grab drive I had if it was better let me see grab drive was it better it's got a little bit better health okay and then I can probably add in some weapons if I really wanted assignments okay so let's take a look at weapon docker yep we're good on docker right basically basically have the uh, smallest docker I can possibly have uh, I misspoke this is going on there. There we go. Okay. I could actually add in some cargo if I really wanted to.
Anybody else feel like the cargo in this game just so weird? Um, weapons. All right. Let's go down to B class weapons. Uh, I don't have. I shouldn't be able to do C class. So I'm not even gonna try. Um, neuron beam. So it kind of oh that's never mind I was looking at the wrong thing let's see yeah I agree with that will very much Storage or cargo gives the ship just such a clunky feel. Kind of tempted just to leave the missiles off and just go with cannons. Lasers. I could just add in some storage on the side there. It kind of looks like a pontoon boat. So, fire rate, um, what was I looking for? Oh, how much energy? Capacity. Max power, two. How much? Max power, three. Hmm. storage cargo sorry there we go cargo how would this look oh that is a no-go i can put it back here uh ship weapons that must be assigned to a group that's it Okay. 
Also, I was kind of surprised that that was it. Little pack rat, man. There you go. That, that's uh, kind of curious to see how this thing would fly now. Now that I've added in some extra weight, I might actually have to add in some more thrusters. My mobility dropped to uh, 67. I don't remember what it was before. This is a B-class ship. Yeah, B-class. So yeah, there's definitely some things you could do with this, like, uh, you can get rid of, uh, you don't have to have all the landing pads that I have here. Uh, I think I, the front one, like you, you have to have at least one on each side. I have uh, the front and the rear for this model type. Um, other than that, you could definitely take those off. But I was kind of wanting the hard points. You could probably even put on, because uh, I think I have the fore and aft ones. You could probably put on the midpoint ones. Probably just fine. But uh, I kind of dig, dig it. I kind of like how it looks. The other thing I actually could really do is add in this hard point uh, for those ballistic cannons and on the sides, add them on the sides and just get more firepower out there. I, I'm i kind of tempted to maybe even do that. I'm gonna have to go really test this out in combat some sometime though. Anyways, let's get a good look at it. 